Don't do it to him. Warden. Four, three, two. Oh my gosh. My team's going in early right away. Not even waiting. We're supposed to be waiting at the 37 minute mark. Holy jeez. What? 7H can't follow the rules. And he's on my team. And it's just straight up E-Dragons here. And I didn't even be able to have an intro to this match. This is supposed to be an E-Dragon match here. Well, let's see here. As he's going to follow right on through. Gonna push straight into the tunnel. The queen is dead. Is, is there sometimes when you're rooting against your teammate and rooting for him not to triple, you know, <laughs> when they don't follow the rules? <laughs> but he's on my team, so I'm, I'm stuck in between. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, make sure to drop your Royal Champion. I town 12, right? Oh my. As a Stone Slammer is going to continue to fly all the way to the top side. Tassa Farm's up there. The King is the best air defense over here. Distracting the E-Dragon. One freeze left. And let's see. Stone Slammer is going to continue to move up. E-Dragon's got to go left and right here. This is hard mode, if that means anything nowadays here. But let's see. E-Drags are still up over there. E-Drag up top. Gonna get some chains. Skip him through. That Rage Gem on the Warden. Keeping the E-Dragon's Rage. Getting the skips. But this E-Drag over here is gonna... is dead. So this one's got a, a, some health here. And that's a... Is that a higher level one? I can't tell. I think so. Yeah, yeah. It looks a little different. So that's a higher level one over there. Now the question is... He's got a minute. Can he make his way over? He'll take... He'll definitely destroy everything. It's all about time. That wizard tower goes down. The arch tower goes down as well. Now nothing else can hurt him. He's got a boatload of E-Dragons here. Oh my goodness. Let's see here. The warden's slowly making his way over. He's got 30 seconds. He's got it. It is a three star. It is indeed. Seven ace delivers a triple, but he doesn't follow the time constraints of when a normal esports type war occurs at 37 minutes. But GG, we start off with a trip. And now the warriors are in here at 34 with two E dragons in the mix. Okay. So this is going to be E dragons here today. It might not be necessarily full E dragons, but there might be. E-Dragons in some blimps. Is there? It is indeed. Okay, let's see what kind of value this E-Dragon over here can get. As we have a couple super barbs. We have some golems. Baby Dragon down to the bottom side. Now the E-Dragon is going to continue to get some chains here. The Rage Gem. We've got a Barbarian Puppet onto the King here. E-Dragon is going to make his way off of there. And it's going to be Lightning Spells onto the Multi to take that down. The nice thing about the lower town halls is you don't have to worry about builder huts. That is very nice. Baby dragon to the bottom continues. More e dragons to the top. We got a couple of super barbs taking out a cannon. E drag. Oh, it is chaining and hitting the multi a little bit, getting some damage. There is a task farm off to the right. Oh boy. E dragon up top dies off the other e-dragon up top as well and we've got a golem we've got a king moving his way a secondary golem with the pekka and the warden all gonna move their way off to the right we got some healers more witches coming out of here well how is he gonna deal with the cc i mean when the golems die and they pop they will do some splash and take out the skelly so that will help snipe that witch really easily with a Warden Eternal Tome to really protect this hero charge. More healers down. So we had E-Dragons to the top side. We had E-Dragons down to the bottom side. Clear each of these compartments and allow this push through. And now the Warden. Air Skellies are quite annoying. It's all about these Golems. I don't know. Can the heroes push their way through the rest of the space? It's going to be the Warden Eternal Tome. And the Town Hall explodes. Waiting. There it is. Town Hall explodes. Warden ability goes off. Doesn't have to worry about getting slowed down or a poison effect from a town hall here. But we have a healers that will come out from the queen. Air skellies are here. We got one headhunter. Uh, drops the head over to the far left. I don't know if he has enough time. Pops that queen ability. Reaches over, gets his air expo. The king dies off. The warren's now going to join in with the queen. Uh-oh. 
time is a ticking. Time is ticking here. Queen's gonna make her way up. We got the Pekkas. Uh oh. 26 seconds. There's no way. Pekka will make its way down south, but there's no way it can clear this. Plus, Queen has to walk around the walls, or she might just go to the bottom side. That cannon is not reachable here. Unless she's got to go around. Oh, she's going down. She's not going to go to the top side. Rip! It is going to be a 96, 97. It's a 98% two star. Nice try with that Yolo Throne, the E Dragon. And our warriors are back in to try to be back on track in terms of the attacking order. Because I will be the final attacker. As we are seeing E Dragons. Coming in with a Queen's Giant Arrow and a Frozen Arrow paired in here. Did he snipe sweepers? I think he did. Okay, we had a single target Inferno here, though. Oh, it locks on the Queen. E-Dragon takes us down. Yes, it does. Allows the Queen to get out of range, and Queen gets raged back up. But does lose a healer. Has a recall spell. Oh, that Queen's going down. Oh, he's got one rage. Oh, she's not going to survive. Rip. Oh, no. Okay. Well, we got the king off to the far right side. We got an E-Dragon all the way to the top side. Rocket Loon's gonna snipe the Arch Tower. The healer gets... Wait. Did the healer not get pulled to that king in the first place? But either way, Rocket Loon's continuing from the top. That E-Dragon up top goes down. And that single target Inferno locks onto the king here. Recalls him. I think he maybe was planning on recalling the queen, but he just had to... Oh, Rocket Spear here. Okay. But the warden's like, nah, I don't want to eat dragon. I'm going to go to the king. King looks better. Oh, no, I'm going to go back. Okay. The uh, warden doesn't know what to do here. He's trying to make up his mind. RC's going to go down. Pops that warden belly. Whoa, protects that blimp. That could have been bad. As the blimp's going to make it to the town hall. There's an earthquake. Tries to poison. Freezing up the headhunters that protect that warden, but it's not going to work. That one gets absolutely shredded as we got a couple freezes and an invis around. Oh boy. There's a freeze down in the single. These E Dragons are trying to stay alive, trying to continue through. They're going to freeze up that Grand Warden altar and freeze up the topside air defense, but tried to be a little bit unique there. Try to have the queen to the right. I think he wanted to recall the queen, but didn't end up doing it. He ended up dying off. Oh, and he, and, he, and he had a fireball as well. He had a fireball as well with the Eternal Tome for that Warden. Nice try. And we're up with Town Hall 13. Hey, look at what is his face here. Okay. Flame Fling at the top. This, this base feels like we're back in like five years ago. Five, six years ago. <laughs> Before... Wait, because four siege machines were a thing. Oh, look at this. That whole tassel farm over here. Was it to try to trap a warden or fireball or something? He does pull out a super dragon early. Which is going to go to the flame flinger. What's going to be your plan for that? Did you plan for that? Um, Uh-oh, your flame flinger is going to be absolutely smoked. Oh, he didn't plan for that. What? Oh, no. What is happening? What is happening? <laughs> What in the world? And you pop an ace the queen ability? Okay, yeah, you get your healers. I can see that. But they go off of the king. I'm so... I'm so confused. What is happening? Dude, the most random stuff is going on. I can't explain it. I have no clue. I am so confused. Okay. The sneaky goblins, I guess, were to set a funnel for the E-Dragons. We've got a war on eternal tone. We've got a healing tone. The Town Hall is there. Pops the Warden ability. Hasn't funneled this side up here. Still has the World Champ. He's got a boatload of freezes here. While the Queen continues. He did walk her way in. Some E-Dragons are making their way to the Town Hall. The Queen is dead. Freezes the Town Hall. RC to the top side. He's got a lot of freezes still. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh my gosh. He got lucky. The RC was like... Oh, let me walk over. Check out the E-Dragons. And she gets absolutely destroyed from the chains. Oh my gosh. Okay. We have another freeze. Got to use it. There we go. Okay. Already popped the RC ability. Oh no. Oh no. She's going down. She's going down. Oh wait. He's got to use it. He does. 
And he's dead. Oh, rip. This, this base did not just defend. Did this... This base just defended? Are you for real? Why did you pull out the clan castle? The clan castle went straight for your flame plane. Did you not notice the CC was over there? Oh. It was an OP super drag. It was. It was an OP super drag. And it's a 90%. Look to us. Oh, GDs. Town Hall 14. The arrow flying through. Holy. Right as I tune in, I see an arrow flying across this base. Seven E dragons. And he doesn't. Okay. Typically, OG here likes to bring a recall. But he's not bringing that here. Man. The anime skin set here. Does have a dragon, but right in front of, right in this air defense range. Okay. Queen's continuing her way across to the left. We have the king that can burn his ability with a spiky ball here. Okay. Gets up to the top side, hits the single target in front of, but freezes it. He didn't miss the freeze on the ground next one, unfortunately. The king is continuing to try. He does not have a phoenix because there is no phoenix at 14. Queen takes out the eagle. That goes down, but the single remains. Now comes the CC of an Ice Hound here. Warden is down with these E-Dragons. Even has the Warden anime skin as well. Sends in this Blimp to go all the way across. Warden ability. Oh, not yet. There it is. Okay, now protects that Blimp perfectly. The Queen is dead. Ripped to the Queen. Was not paying attention to her. Now that Blimp makes it to the Town Hall. And we've got a, an Inferno... Oh, an Inferno Dragon here. The Warden continues to try to get these E-Dragons into the space the single target in front of remains he's gonna freeze rage that section the dragon goes down that e dragon is trying to get some chains oh he's not paying attention he's not paying attention this e dragon is gonna die oh it dies but the the lightning could kill off the okay the rc's ability takes out that okay either way he's got a lot of spells he's not using them he's not using the spells it makes the king invisible so she doesn't go for him snipes the air defense Poisons up the king to go for him. Got to drop some minions down to the bottom side. Does he still have enough? There's a raid on the E-Drags to the top. Okay. The Warden's sniping the E-Drags targets. Freezes up that air expo. He's got a rage yet again. There's a rage for the RC. But only got like two shots off, unfortunately. Not dropping the minions. I don't know why. These E-Drags would have benefited greatly from the rage. But he might be able to pull away with it. Hang on. That E-Drag dies. The Grand Warren Altar goes down. Oh my gosh. It might not have been pretty, but three star is a three star, right? It looks like he's going to get it. I don't know why you weren't using your spells, but hey, you got to get it. Wait, is he? Is he? Wait, time. Nothing else other than these buildings here. 24 seconds. All right, these E-Drags are slow. This storage is going to be the, the deciding factor because the mini won't get it in time. Is he going to get it? 14 seconds. E dragons are taking their sweet time. They're taking their sweet time. 10 seconds. Oh, this is gonna be close. Oh, this is gonna be close. Oh, this is gonna be close. No, don't do it to him. Don't do it to him. Warden. Four, three, two. Oh my gosh, the warden saves the day. He gets it. That's a. Uh, that's gonna raise your heart right there. We're gonna go an early warden with a couple balloons to snipe the cannons, then ability. Which snipes the wizard tower. He did not go for the mortar. Ta oh, and then he hates those headhunters to fly all the way across. So he's going to invis the E-Drag, which goes for the CC. Oh my goodness. He's going to clone up the E-Dragons now. And so he's going to try to have the E-Dragons go for the town hall as well. Look at this. Holy, okay. Town hall goes down. Multi goes down. Now he's going to go for the super dragon as well. Does he take that down? No. Interesting. All right. Now he drops an archer to the top side, which is pulling that super dragon. Ice golem, king, queen, all together up there to move their way through. Now they're going to path their way and take out the defensive king as a druid. Drops a poison spell as well. Drops an e dragon, and he's got a druid on an e dragon. There you go. You finally can heal up some air troops. I like it. Four Rockaloons to use. 
That druid is doing some work, helping that E-Drag over there stay alive. RC is down now, so he's using a skeleton spell. More balloons to the left, or rock balloons as well to go try to snipe that single and also distracting it so the E-Dragon doesn't get locked onto. Fantastic value over there. Now the Queen's continue, he does have her ability. RC with the hogs, pops the ability right now. RC is continuing, she got a lot of health back. This is looking good here for Fatal. Phoenix is moving through with the Queen ability. Gonna be able to continue to push through balloons up top. And what a plan here. Oh my. You know, you could cook up some crazy with the E-Dragons. Oh, RC's trying her best to stay alive. Oh, she goes down. But he's got the Queen ability. And E-Dragon. Two, three E-Dragons still alive. Moving his way to the backside. He's got a Sneaky Goblin. And he's good. He's gonna go for this wall. And it's a three-star. That was nice. He broke this base down right through. Gonna be able to pop the queen ability. There's the sneaky down south. Finishes that off. And it is a three-star answering right on back here. GG. Well done to you, Phoenix. It's a trip. With 70 dragons, there's the arrow flying right on through here. And we've got the healers passing off to the king. We saw this earlier. It's going to be the king walk. <laughs> the king is going... Oh, wait. He was back to the queen. Okay. All right. E-drag off to the right. Getting sniped as a sacrificial E-dragon to the E-dragon gods. Got to make sure that uh, you can continue. <laughs> Got to let that E-dragon die. Queen's going to continue her way off to the left. Cannot wall break her through. Okay. So that multi-target inferno is not reachable. What is he going to do about it? E-drag... Oh, never mind. Queen will go for her favorite target. So she can grab that multi. Very smart queen. As that warning ability is protecting that blimp. Flying all the way across. And he's going to clone. Not going to... Oh, no, no, no. Not like this. Not like this. Not like that. No. Not like that. Oh, rip. Oh, not like that either. Jesus. These headhunters. Stop. Stop it. Wait, no. Keep it. Wait, no. What am I talking about? Keep going. Keep going, headhunters. Keep going, headhunters. What an OPCC, dude. Absolutely shredding every hero. Holy jeez. Those are the best headhunters in the game. My goodness. <laughs> dude, these heroes got absolutely destroyed by our headhunters. I forgot that this is our base defending. Oh my goodness. I am in nice try. Man, those headhunters. They were... Woof. Snipe to Warden, snipe the Queen, snipe the Royal Champion. Had no answer for him. Uses a freeze to the top side here to take freeze up the air defense and the wizard tower. This air this E Dragon to the left goes off on his own. They're gonna die off, and this is gonna be a two-star here. It's gonna be a two. He did indeed use Sneaky Goblins for the town hall. He did indeed. I saw that, but I was focusing on the headhunters. But it is another two-star! And it's two stars, after two stars, after two stars. And OG's the only one to triple. We're in. And let's see. What? Oh, the queen down here. All right. I see. I see. We have a king off to the right. We got the queen down to the bottom. Queen's going through this Grand Warren altar. Pekka's and Pekka's off to the right side. And the king and Pekka's are going to take out the enemy queen over here. Does it carry in a wall breaker? Now the queen is going to continue her way. Going to grab the seagull artillery. That jump spell is going to look to try to give that king value. He does come back around. But... Oh no, more headhunters. Oh gosh, oh gosh. We know what's already happened with them. E-dragons to the bottom side. Queen's going to continue her way. And there's an... Wait, there's an overgrowth. I forgot that even is there. I wasn't even thinking about it. Super minions coming out of the siege barracks. Can these E-Dragons continue their way through? And what's your plan for the... Wait a second. These E-Dragons need to make their way all the way through here. Uh-oh. Hang on. Monolith is going down. These Ice Combs are going to freeze up. Okay. He changed through towards the Town Hall, but it can't do any damage to it. Oh, wait. Now I... Wait. I just thought about... An Overgrowth in E-Dragon is actually not good because you... It will still... Wait. Did it? It still changed. Shouldn't those be invisible? But it still changed. So the chains we'll still go through buildings that are hit with an overgrowth wait no don't give him a one no don't one star no 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 wait a sec hold on oh no i already sent the rc oh gosh 
You can't lose this RC or this queen here. Um, guys. He's got no wall breaker for the town hall compartment. Um, um, uh, wait a second. Wait a second. This RC needs to clear this. Does he have a chance of getting... Is he either a triple or a one star? It's not a two. Oh, no. This queen's dead. Pops RC. There's a rage. Or it might be a two unless the RC saves it. There's a freeze. Oh, he gets it. It is a two. Wait, is it a three? Tunnel explodes. Hogs avoid. Taking out the defensive king perfectly. Wait, what? The RC is saving the day. The healer's keeping her up. Taking out the wizard tower? No way! It worked! Oh my gosh, I thought this was going to be a one. Holy, what an OP RC and her ability. The hogs, rage, freeze combo, save the day, and it's a triple! The RC with the hogs, clutching it up. It was sketchy, but you know, a three star is a three. And we'll take it. Koji is up. All right. With a warden and an angry jelly fireball e-dragons. Hang on. This is something similar to what I'm doing, but I'm not, I might not put the angry jelly on my warden here. What are you doing? Eight e-dragons. There's that King Spiky Ball. Takes out some of the stuff on the side of the Queen. There's the Warden. Okay. Warden ability is going to go through. Overgrowth over there. Pops it. Does take out the Clan Castle. Oh, no. The CC does not go down. The Builders were there. The CC stays up. And now the Blip is trying to make its way to that Town Hall. And the Ice Golems come out of the CC now. Balloon taking out the Town Hall. Town Hall has been secured. King's already burned his ability. Queen is getting slowed down. Does have the maxed out magic mirror. So we've got three queens and they're all three queens all going for a wall. You can get through the wall three times faster. There you go. <laughs> Who would have thought? Three. If one queen going through a wall is not enough, now you got three queens going through a wall. <laughs> oh my. And now the balloons are going to continue through this bottom side through here. Royal Champ does have her ability with a rocket spear, making her invisible, but the ability going off early here. We do have a ground expo that is here. Grounds can... No, they're going to... Oh, that's right. The rocket spear does splash damage. So it'll take out the Scally's one shot. I forgot about that. But rip the Koji here. e drags chained through the Tesla, so they can't take out the air defense there. So they're going to hit that. Stay on the outside and bye bye to that E-Dragon. Rip. Nice try. Oh boy. We just need a one star. Let's go. Okay. All right. So, according to my calculations, I think so this is maybe I could get away with one here. I think I can get away with one. Let's see. So, can I go with one? One like that? All right, dude, dude, no, I can't. Okay, I couldn't. I had to go with more. That was my original plan. I thought I might be able to reach all of them, but we're good. All right, Warden, you grab this. So, Rocket Loon here. Rocket Loon here. Castles, all right. Rocket Loon here. All right, so we're taking this down. Let the Warden. All right, so let's see what we can do here. One more here. See where that goes. All right. There's tornado. All right. We're going to leave that be. We're going to send an E Dragon here. I'm going to do a king like this. I'm going to do another Rackling up here. And a limp. Okay. Do the queen. Do the very different type of attack. A wall break this. Okay. Warden is gonna die. Okay, that's fine. He's gonna come back to life. Try to jump, jump here. Through it. Okay, the king does not want to take that jump. Why? 
Does he? Does it? Phoenix snap the town hall? Okay, does it? Oh, King's going that way. All right. Drop an E dragon here and here. Okay. At this point, what are we doing here? King spiky ball. I think the king spiky ball should be used. Yeah. Snipe the. Oh, it doesn't go for the town hall. Hello. Okay. And go for that. We gotta send the RC now. E dragons around. Okay, RC. Pop ability. The ground skellies. Oh, see, I wanted the king to take the jump over to the left. E drags. Over here. Queen's coming through. Still have her ability. Arrow through there. Let's get an E dragon right here to try to chain. Queen is going for a wall. Okay. Oh, he's chaining through the enemy queen. Taking her down. Queen is going for that wall. E dragon dies. Oh. It's up to my queen. Chains through that. 32 seconds. Rip. I don't have any healers on the queen. Drop an archer down to the scatter. E dragon. Do something. Rip. 95. No, my king never took the jump. Oh, and I didn't drop the jump straight to the core. It was close. 94. There's the druid tag in a bit. Scatter will go down. Almost. And queen's dead. Rip. 97% almost with that warden fireball there. But hey, all I needed was a one star and we got it, which is a victory right here. There was a couple handful of triples, 13 to 11. Carbon Fit takes the victory. GG, let's go.